Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Pure Ice, Howling Wind, and Respect. I'm going to do Ghost and Skulls. I started off with Neltique's Formula 2 and applied China Glaze Liquid Leather. And then I applied this hair beauty called Howling Wind. Now I did my accent nails with the other colors. Oh, and I topped those with Fast and Hard. <laughs> But I used this color. I had to steal a picture so you could see it. Um, Aaron's Enamel did these. And that's on my, um, I think it's my ring and my thumb. There we go. I'm going to use in my Born Pretty White and Beauty Big Bangs 03. And Beauty Big Bang 04. My Beauty Big Bang Scraper and my Starry Night Stamper from Born Pretty. So I'm just going to use some different images, just different skulls and, um, you know, ghosts. That's the theme for today's manicure, ghost and skulls. You'll have to excuse me, my voice is starting to get scratchy. Tis the season. <laughs> but I am going to try to get through this, and um, you might get a couple of videos that are, you know, scratchy voice. <clears throat> Now this little image with all the different skulls is just so cute. Now I'm not into the gore of Halloween. I'm just not a gory kind of person. I like the cutie pie part of Halloween. Um, but I kind of feel like I'm getting close to that line on this one. But it's okay. I'm, I wasn't scared by this manicure or bothered by it. I really thought it was cute. So here we go. We're going to line that up you see how I do it um, it is tricky using the non clear stampers and that one's so not straight but I kind of like that it was kind of cocked to the side a little bit and here we go with our ooh ghosty faces I like it though I'm uh, running out of time to do all the manicures I want to do for Halloween so now we're going to get into using a lot of different images and different polishes on the nails and <laughs> things like that because uh, I want to just get as many in as I can. There we go. And now for the pinky, I'm going to use these skull and crossbones. I love it though. I love Halloween manicures. They're just, they are some of my favorites. Look at that glitter going on with that thumb. Oh, it's jumping out at you. So there we go. I'm going to do a little bit of cleanup here with some tape. Just a little bit. And this white's coming up pretty good. This is that white from Born Pretty and it's and it's doing rather well today. Camera's having trouble focusing on me. There we go. There we go. We've got that pretty cleaned up. I like it. But I am going to go in with my acetone and my cleanup brush. And try to tidy up just a little bit more. Try to get that all nice and cleaned up. Because once I top coat it, there, you know, sometimes I tuck, top coat the mess in. And then it's even harder to get up. So I just like to go ahead and do it before I do the top coat. Loving that duochrome underneath the white. I'll be using the smudge free top coat from Bundle Monster, which is now Maniology. And I'm going to seal this in before I do my regular top coat. And you can see it's not smearing that white at all. And white is one of the stamping polishes I had a lot of trouble with on the smearing before. So I'm really happy that they've come out with products like this for us to use. You want to put all that time and effort into a mani and have it smeared. But look, I'm going over it and brushing around, and it's not moving. I love it. I'll be using the Fast and Hard from Vibrant Vinyls today. Over everything. I love them. Um, I have really been, and I know y'all have seen me using this here lately, and I have really enjoyed it. Um, it's been a really nice top coat. It smells good. <laughs> I know that sounds funny to hear somebody saying, oh, that top coat smelled good, but it did. It smelled really good. There we go. 
being sure to cap my tips so that that mani will last a little bit longer. <clears throat> Gotta break Woody out. Woody Woody to the rescue. Cleaning up Mama's mess. So there it is. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about my skulls and ghosts. <laughs> I've got some swatch photos coming up because I was trying to capture all the beautifulness of this Manny. So leave me a comment down below, like I said, and let me know what you think about it. I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon.